we're at the third leg of a three-part um, study that we've been doing since, oh, 2010, um, when we went out with the O-Search to Revier Quijedos and we tagged several species of sharks to understand their movements within the Revier Quijedos Marine Reserve and also between different marine reserves. And after that, in 2011, we went to Cocos Island and we repeated the same study. And finally, we're here in Galapagos. So we should probably just go over the objectives and just see what we're going to do over the next few days. Okay. So one of the things that's a little <coughs> bit different about this particular study is that we've decided to focus not just on sharks, but really on the whole pelagic assemblage. Because we have a unique situation here with Darwin and Wolf being so close to each other, and they almost act as a single unit. Um, mm. So by tagging several species, not just the, the protected sharks, but some of the commercial species, we can understand how this Darwin Wolf complex is, is contributing to, uh, to, to local fisheries, maybe industrial fisheries outside the marine reserve, as well as the conservation. We're going to look at the top predator right the way down to some of the you know, mesopredatory species. So that means the tiger shark, uh, which we've all already tagged, and Cocos Cocos River here, hammerhead sharks, silky sharks, and then yellowfin tuna, wahoo, skipjack, and rainbow runners. These are more kind of the, the, the lower level fish. So that's seven species that we want to pick up, and we really want 10 of most of those, but I think we'll be happy with you know, five tiger sharks and maybe you know, any, any hammerhead will be good, <laughs> but we'll try and get 10 of all the, all the fish species and the silky sharks. Cool. I'd love to be able to get blood from, if not all, but most of the sharks that we tag, just mm -hmm. to look at, you know, that correlation basically between the blood stress parameters and, and then you know looking at what they do afterwards and stuff like that. Um, we're kind of building this database now of stress physiology in different species of shark and you know with OSEARCH we've had the white sharks and now we're able to look at you know these hammers and tigers and see what you know the different species responses are to the capture and tagging process so I'd love to be able to build that up. Yeah, for me, one of the main objectives is, are the wahoos. Wahoos are one of the most important commercial species here in Galapagos. Mm -hmm. And we have already started a study in the center of archipelago. We have been tagging with acoustic tags, 10 wahoos. And also we are trying to, to understand the reproductive calendar through the gonads study. So we are expect, expect, expecting to, to complement this study with the world of an island. We haven't tagged any, any wahoos here before. We know they are here, we know they come, the fishermen come here to fish them, so we are expecting to, to deploy or to put uh, 10 acoustic tags and also hopefully another four uh, satellite tags. It's going to be the first time we, we tag uh, Wahoos with satellite tags in Galapagos. Eh, la expedición de OSHA es muy importante para el Parque Nacional Galápagos porque queremos aunar eh, con el programa que lleva el Parque Nacional eh, con demás instituciones, un programa de tiburones que lleva alrededor de siete años. Eh, hemos marcado diferentes especies de tiburones, tenemos varios objetivos como también poner receptores para ver los movimientos de, de las especies, tenemos diferentes eh, marcajes como acústicos y satelitales, lo que están haciendo aquí también en, el, en la expedición. Con este proyecto, con este viaje, vamos a poder eh, implementar otras especies, estudiar diferentes, bueno, el ensamblaje pelágico y poder eh, tener una información más completa. So really, with a study of this magnitude, it's really great that we can be back here on OSEARCH mm -hmm. and that Caterpillar have funded the, the, the team to come over here because it's just such a large undertaking. Um, and, and then, of course, the, the, the lift. I mean, mm -hmm. there's no way we could really even begin to tackle the tiger shark is issue without something like this. So the magnitude of the study and the, the, the resources that are on the boat mm -hmm. make it it's such an opportunity. And it's yeah. something that, that we've been working for here in Galapagos for a long time to get this multi-species thing going. Absolutely, so, yeah. yeah. That's exciting. Let's get started. Great. Yeah, yeah, let's go for it. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs>